You know, look, it's uh, as of this moment when you're interviewing me, you know, Fox News is projecting a, a 60 seat pickup in the U.S. House of Representatives. You know, I don't know. How, there's no other way you can describe it. It's a bottom up movement. I mean, this started at, at town halls. This started at Tea Party rallies across the country. You know, uh, organic as can be. There's not a single leader. There's not, you know, a, a, a single host. There's not a single candidate. There is just this movement, this organic movement. People feeling, rightly so, I agree with, that the country's been moving in the wrong direction. Too much in terms of debt and deficits and, and reckless spending and government control in their lives. And they're saying, you know what? Tonight they're sending a message. We've had enough. We're going to change Washington. And we're going to move the country in a, in a more constitutional direction. You know, it's, it's, it's too early to tell. I mean, there's a lot of great people. We have a whole process to run through. Who's going to be running is, is obviously going to be a big part of the equation. Uh, I would argue that whatever it is that the Democrats wanted to do, you know, is now get stopped in its tracks. Cap and tax, uh, I don't think that's going to happen. It's going to be a big, huge battle over the issue of repealing health care. Uh, uh, you know, whether or not uh, they, they advance the Bush tax cuts is certainly going to be, you know, up for debate now. So, you know, it's, it's going to be a very interesting time in Washington, around the country. But one thing that's happened, I, I think that everybody's got to understand, is that th the energy in this country, the enthusiasm, the engagement, you know, I've been following this since I first voted for Ronald Reagan in 1980, is unprecedented and unlike anything I've ever seen. Yeah, he's going to get out of town as quickly as possible. And, uh, you know, I, I think there's going to be a lot of anger. My prediction is I, I think a lot of Democrats have been in denial. I'll be, I think there'll be this excuse-making uh, maybe we didn't communicate well, and and this is uh, um, you know anything but the country's rejecting their high debt, their record deficits. Anything but they reject their stimulus. Anything but that they reject their health care. This is a repudiation of the Obama agenda, which is fairly radical, and this is not the change that America thought they were getting. And America speaking loudly tonight that they want to get the country on the right course.